Okay, good morning folks. Uh, welcome to uh, Beer Road Bee Farm. Uh, it's been a couple of weeks since we've been out to the hive. Uh, had VBS uh, last week and uh, it's been pretty busy. So, uh, yeah, it's uh, June 28th, 2014 and uh, two weeks ago we put the uh, queen excluder on. So I'm uh, going to go out and check on that and uh, we'll see if there's actually any uh, uh, movement, any production, uh, if they're drawing out any comb in the uh, honey super uh, up on top and uh, we'll see about uh, uh, either leaving it or taking that queen excluder out. Uh, some people call it the uh, honey excluder and not the queen excluder because it excludes uh, not just the uh, queen from getting up there but the bees too. So. Uh, we're going to check that out today and see how it goes. Okay, here we go. Bees have been uh, really active here the last uh, week, I've noticed, as I uh, look out from the house. I've uh, seen them uh, really outside the hive on top here a lot. So it uh, seems to be pretty, uh, pretty busy here this morning. It's about 11 o'clock in the morning, uh, quarter till 11 or so. Lots of activity there. So I brought some, uh, brought some more uh, syrup for them. And uh, we'll dig in there and check things out and see how it's going. Uh, so far, no guard bees. I think they've been a little bit more calm. I did come out the other night and uh, put some uh, Put some more uh, sugar water on there for them and uh, I tried to do it with my bare hands and uh, one of the bees walked up on me and stung me right in the finger but uh, they weren't real aggressive or anything and didn't really attack me but uh, for some reason she felt the need to uh, to zap me so uh, so oh well but uh, lots and lots and lots of activity there lots of bees coming and going here so the hive looks really really good so curious to see now uh, if the uh, if the activity is uh, the same up on top here. So let's uh, I'm gonna dig in here a little bit and check this out and uh, see how it's going, okay? So let's do this, do that. Let's crank this up a little bit and get a little more of a bird's eye view of what's going on here. Kinda like that. See how that, uh, see how that works, okay? Maybe we'll start by uh, giving them some sugar water. I'm not sure if that either helps or or not, but uh, that thing's been dry, I think, since yesterday. So we'll try to get that uh, that replaced. cool thing here is too so far no guard bees have really given me any kind of problem here so that's uh, that's really good very happy about that all right girl you're just gonna have to wait I'm sorry you're gonna have to wait until uh, and get off of there, there you go. There we go. Get this off. Get this in there. There's a dead bee in there too, inside the Okay. Right, let's try this. Right, here we go. Be in there. Oh. Oh, no. 
boy, the hive really smells like honey today too. Wow. Big wasp of that coming out of there. Okay, let's get into this and see what uh, see what is or isn't going on. any activity up here. I've seen nothing going on sadly. The uh, releasing of that seemed to uh, get a reaction. Ah, there's some bees up here. That's good. That's good. Okay. We do have some uh, Action going on here. Uh, yeah, I like this better. Put it back here. Like that. See if they're doing. Uh, <laughs> that one acts like it's doing uh, putting propolis on the uh, thing there to stick those together, which is funny. Lots of other work that needs to be done. So let's see if any of this is getting done here. There's some bees on there. But so far, nothing. Nothing on that one. So we'll set that down there. Yeah, I don't see a whole lot of nothing going on there. There are some bees that are uh, getting up and down through there. But I think I'm going to take, uh, it's been two weeks, and there's actually nothing, I don't see any evidence that they're doing anything up here with drawing this out. So, based on that, I think I'm going to uh, take that excluder off of there, and I'm just going to let happen, let what happens, happens. If uh, the queen gets up there and lays eggs, fine, and makes more bees, that's fine. I actually think, uh, based on this, especially with all the activity below, uh, they need more space, um, and this can provide them with the space that they uh, want to grow. Uh, and if they, if she wants to uh, lay eggs up here and use this as uh, a place to, uh, to do that, that's fine. If they make honey up here, uh, that's fine too. I think even what I'm going to do, and I thought of this uh, over the last couple of weeks, that, uh, that I would just uh, put the other honey super on there that I have too. I'm just going to put them both on there. I'm going to take that, whoops, sorry girl, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, you all right? Kind of squished her there. Um, but I think I'm just going to uh, put them both on there. And I'm just going to let them uh, use all that space. So, because they're not doing any hard work up here yet. So, only a few bees are getting up here. So, uh, I'm going to get that honey, uh, <laughs> I'm going to call it that too. I'm going to call it the honey excluder. <laughs> That uh, seems to be what's happening here. They're, they're, they've done absolutely nothing with this. There aren't any uh, frames that I've found yet where they've even started to draw a comb out of. Um, so they're doing absolutely nothing with this. So to try to encourage their uh, activity, I'm going to get that uh, excluder off of there. That one's got some goop on it, like they've uh, got some propolis built up on there, so they're trying to seal it up. But uh, in my opinion, my unprofessional opinion, I'm tending to agree with the professionals that uh, the excluder does nothing but uh, exclude the honey. So. Got some goop going on down there. Too much goop and not enough, uh, not enough drawing of comb. So my guess is that that's uh, really doing exactly what they say. 
and uh, keeping them from uh, actively uh, working on that. So, okay. So we're going to do that. I'm going to take this off of there. And get that excluder off of there. back together like that center that up there like that peel this off like that try to get this off of there as well We go. I think it's loose. Um, let's do, yeah, we'll do that. Like that. Ooh, actually, um, before we. Uh, yeah, I'm afraid of that. Yeah, I didn't come up with a good plan to. Uh, put that down on something so um, really probably don't have to do a whole lot here I can probably do a quick little deal like this peel that up off of there like that and I'd rather not shake those bees off of there uh, so we'll uh, put this down here like this matter like that I'm going to put this back on here like that things moved while I did that so we're gonna do this like that try to get that back off of there now like this Try to get the girls back down on here. Yeah, that's not going to be an easy thing to do. I really don't want to have to shake them off of there. Um, I don't know if I can get them to march off of there. This would be an interesting uh, event here. See if I can get them to roll down into there, down into the hive. Maybe not easily. Ah, looks like I hurt that one. Okay, so let's try to do something that looks like that. That may not work either. Get them to go back down in there. I may be left with shaking them. Get them off of there. Well, they're very calm, which is very, very, very good. Very happy about that. I've not really had one uh, aggressive guard bee at me, so that's uh, awesome. It's exactly what we want. So whatever that little uh, episode was there for a couple of weeks seems to be uh, subsided. Um, the girls are very, very gentle. Today. <laughs> Qualify that a little bit. 
Um, so let's see. Gonna figure out a way to try to gently get them uh, off of there. I don't know if this is uh, an option here. That's just gonna mess up the flight pattern of the girls up there. But if we tried to do something that looked like this, try to run them down this way, crowd them down into uh, into there. that are on this side. Let's turn it around and try the other side. See if we can run them down that way. Working pretty good there. Almost like I knew what I was doing. Almost.